Hey folks, Sebastian here, showmeat.com. I want to let y'all know I won the bet. And this was the bet. My man, Sean Wilson. For those of you who don't know, Sean Wilson Piano is an amazing channel. This guy breaks down some of the most amazing cats chords and what they're doing, giving you some input on like mindset and approach. Make sure you check out his channel. I was driving the other day and I was listening to Bishop Omer from Faithful Central out in LA and he was preaching a message about the whole George Floyd situation and he said some interesting things but at the end of the message, I'm going to see if I can leave a link for you in the uh, below. But the most interesting thing at the end of the video, this music started playing and they did this vamp on Lord, You Are Good. And the chords this dude dropped in there, I was like, my God. I said, I got to hit up Sean for this one. And see, I know Sean, he hears a lot of people. He hears a lot of people playing. But I was telling him, I said, Doc, you got to hear these chords. These chords is going to make you stop what you're doing. He's like, yeah, 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 yeah. And he was on his way to church. So he hit me back later, said, hey, bro, I'm going to have a little present for you. So since I won the bet, He's doing a breakdown right here on Show Me That, okay? So you make sure you stay tuned right after that. Check this out and make sure you go over and you support his channel. Amazing guy, amazing work that he's doing over there. All right, check this when out. In order to cry, you gotta care. Man, I knew I was gonna lose this bet. <clears throat> and I really don't think many of you. Sebastian sent me a text. He said, Sean, you gotta listen to the song. Man, like, I'm on my way to because you church. Don't he said, man, look, if you hear these chords, like you're going you're going <laughs> you have to stop what you're doing. I'm like, man, shit, if I if I like this thing, I'm going to break it down on your channel, man. If it if it has that too much effect on me. So here Come I am back next Sunday, if you can. <laughs> so I decide I'm going to do this for Sebastian. Yes, channel. How you guys doing? My name is Sean Wilson. Check out my channel. God bless you. But I want you to hear what this keyboard is doing. And I want to present it on Sebastian's channel. Um, you've been so good on the vamp, and the pianist is killing it. So I want y'all to just listen to it. Uh. Ah, what are those chords? Sebastian was like, "Come on, Sean." <laughs> They've got such a nice sound here, man. Hey, they're gonna do it again, check this out. We're gonna show you what these are, let's do it. So those chords, what are those passing chords? Those are the passing chords to this A flat because they're in you've been, right? They did keep on that so good. You've been. Right, so so let's let's find out what those are. So um, those chords are gonna be it's actually gonna be four notes. Okay, in the left hand play this A flat and the D, which is a tritone. So it's gonna sound like this. Let me do the whole. Let me show you how it goes first. See, that's how it sounds. Y'all want this in your vocabulary? Go ahead and memorize it. So check it out. A flat D. Nice bright sound here going to a nice dark sound here, G, C, F, B flat. And then we're gonna have a, a diminished sound, which is very tense, which is G, C sharp, E, and B flat, and back to this, 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 this uh, minor seven, four sound. And you notice the parallel structure of this, because you've got a, to a, you have a G minor seven, four, and then you have an F minor seven, four, and then this, voicing here which leads us to a D flat chord and the reason why it leads us to a D flat chord is because they're using the F sharp melodic minor 
as a basis for the movement. And within the F sharp melodic minor scale, right, it leads us to a D flat, but within that scale is this voicing right here. Right? So the F sharp melodic minor is leading us there. Now this movement here, the passing chords aren't coming from that. The passing chords is just melodic. So, um, what was it again? Yeah. There you go. All right, so let's play that with them. Let's see how, let y'all hear how it sounds. Yeah. You guys see that part there? See, I'm using the F sharp melodic minor there. So it's gonna be a quick video. <laughs> So bad shit, I ain't gonna keep them long, man. But you guys, y'all check that song out, man. And by the way, if this song's in D flat, but most of y'all used to playing this on in B flat. You've been so good. So now we, we'd have to trans translate that, all right? I would almost say transpose. This, this keyboard don't have a transpose button, so I can't <laughs> I can't transpose it. Yeah. So if I'm in B flat, you know what I'm saying? I'm I'm at I'm at you've been, which is a key that you guys are playing it in. Uh, mostly so good I'm using the uh, you've been yeah I'm gonna use the E flat melodic minor here so you've been so good yeah so see instead of instead of falling from here or instead of going, now I'm going. See, so this is the voicing now that we're using for this key. It has to totally change here. Yeah, I think I'll change it like that. B-flat. <laughs> You've been so good. You've been Yeah, so this is some cool stuff, man. They learned this song and Sebastian Shout out to your channel, man. You've been doing some great stuff. Come back next Sunday if you can. Um, doing some great stuff over there. Let's hear um, what God so. says next. Sebastian, here you go, man. Those are the chords. <laughs> See y'all later, man.